A grim reminder today that the life of a law enforcement officer is a dangerous one. Good afternoon and thanks so much for joining us. I'm Melissa Martin. Emily Leonard and Craig Ford both have the day off. It was six years ago today that Sergeant Gail Stauffer was killed in the line of duty. He was trying to arrest a bank robber here in Tupelo. Today, Tupelo police held a memorial in his honor at the police station this morning. WTVA's Wayne Herford joins us live. He was there and shares the memories of the fallen officer. Kevin Gale Stauffer Jr. was only 38 years old when he was shot and killed by a bank robber near Crosstown here in Tupelo back on this day in 2013. It's been six years, but for those who remember him, the memory is still strong. Lord, I know that this is a hard time for his family. It's a hard time for all of us because, Lord, it brings back those memories. The memories of Sergeant Gail Starford Jr. remain in the hearts and minds of his family, friends, and colleagues Monday morning as officers laid a wreath in his honor behind the Tupelo Police Department where there is already a memorial named in his honor. His mother was on hand. She says it's still hard to forget that tragic day in 2013. Every year you think, well, it'll be better. And the time comes along and, and it is a, it's a difficult day. But what keeps her going, she says, is the knowledge that her son may be gone but not forgotten. But what I remember the most is how this community came together across all economic lines, all race, all ethnicities, everything. It was on Gloucester Street near Crosstown. Here, Stauffer and his fellow officer, Joseph Marr, were shot by the bank robber. At the time, neither officer knew who the bank robber was. Tupelo Police Chief Barta Gary remembers December 23, 2013, as a normal day before the shooting took place. It was uh, very joyful, and then uh, I got that call, you know, that dreaded call that called the any police uh, chief or officer hates to hear, you know, you got an officer down. Officer Joseph Marr survived the shooting that day. Gail Stauffer did not. The chief and the mayor both say that since then, they have taken measures to ensure the safety of the city's officers. The city, our police department, is constantly striving to increase uh, our safety protocol procedures, equipment, uh, for our officers, for our firefighters. Uh, the new facility here that you can see behind me, uh, we're working on a new gated structure around it. And it's number one, training, 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 training. We're all on this earth together to make a better place, and our law enforcement try to do that, try to help us stay safe. Sergeant Stauffer is survived by his wife and two children. As I said earlier, he was 38 years old. He also was a Iraq War veteran. He served in the Iraq War as a member of the Louisiana Army National Guard. Reporting live in Tupelo, I'm Wayne Herford, WTVA 9 News.